15 mile an hour sustained winds, but the gusts are still out there over 20, 25 miles an hour in some cases. Those are all going to die down as we head towards sunset tonight. So not a lot to look at satellite wise. There's some activity here uh, that could be affecting folks up north as we get into the upcoming weekend. But around here, we're watching the lack of rain. The drought monitor came out again this week and the, mostly it's the north zone and a little bit of our uh, metro zone that's affected just a smattering there in the south zone. This is not drought, but it's what we call pre drought or abnormally dry conditions uh, that obviously could expand because we do not have a lot of rain in this forecast. There's only one good shot and that's not going to get here until Tuesday of next week. So do enjoy the dry weather over the upcoming weekend. There's going to be a lot of sunshine, low humidity, wind shouldn't be a problem. So everything in, in that respect working in our favor uh, was we get into Sunday. There's a warm front, as we mentioned, just going to sort of move in close to us. This is Sunday at 11 o'clock. Now right now, doesn't look like there's going to be any precipitation along that front, but we're going to watch it pretty carefully because that's also going to be our warmest day of the week uh, of the forecast, I should say, at 85 in the afternoon. Just not going to be a ton of humidity with it. Here are the lows tonight and very comfortable sleeping weather. So if you've had the windows closed and the AC running, uh, you may want to open them up tonight. 60 degrees in the city. That's probably the only spot that's actually going to see a 60 degree number. Everybody else should finish in the 50s as we get into uh, early parts of tomorrow. 54 out in Adrian. Marincy and Einstein, you're going to be at 54 as well. Numbers may go as low as 53 out here in the uh, western portion of our west zone, but that's probably as low as we're going to see. Still enough cloud cover and just enough wind to keep those temperatures from falling all the way to the dew points, which in some cases are going to be in the upper 40s tonight. 58 uh, officially for that low temperature at the airport and then high side gets us to 81 with plenty of sunshine uh, that really that forecast is gorgeous for most of it. It's oh. just we're getting to the point where we could use more than just one.